Alright boys, I'm gonna be doing a um, gaming setup tour for 2019. So this is gonna be strictly going over like recording, streaming, like editing, whatever you want. Not that I do that, but I'm getting into the streaming more. My Twitch is twitch.tv forward slash it's both I have an open screen there. If you want to follow me on that, I'm streaming a lot more than what I used to. Um, so I'm going to start from all my streaming side and I'm going to work my way over to this bit then as well. Okay, so starting off from this side of my desk, just small things here. This is my Steel Series headset for when I do travel with my laptop, which I'm going to get into in a second. Uh, Nintendo Switch, um, Google Home, Power Brick for my um, laptop, which is very very big as you can see it's very thick and the length of it compared to my switch here is pretty long and i'm going to explain why it is so big in a second um that's just a 3.0 usb hub and my elgato hd 60s which captures gameplay from my gaming computer and sends it to my streaming computer now you may think it's a laptop why are you using that as a streaming computer this laptop's very different very expensive as well um, in this laptop is a Ryzen 7 1700, which is actually a full desktop CPU. It's not just a laptop CPU. This is a full desktop CPU. Uh, it has an RX 580, 16 gigabytes of RAM, a 256 gigabyte SSD, and a one terabyte hard drive. That's the reason why the power brick is so big and so thick, because this requires a lot of power as it is a full desktop CPU, which is great for me because I needed something that I can use to travel with or go over to friends, play games. Um, this laptop, for if you were wondering, was around 1600 euros, I do believe. But for the specifications in it, it's definitely, definitely worth it. Moving on to my gaming PC then, I built this PC myself. Um, the case is a Corsair uh, 570X, I believe, or something like that. Um, in this then, I have a Intel i7-8700K. Um, I have 32 gigabytes of DDR4 RAM clocked at 3200 megahertz. Um, all my fans and LED, uh, LED strips are by Corsair. Um, and the same with my cooler. Um, that's my MSI Aero 1080 Ti. And for storage, I have two SSDs and two hard drives. Um, I have one 500 gigabyte SSD, a 256 gigabyte SSD, and I have a one terabyte hard drive and a two terabyte hard drive. So I have SSDs dedicated for One's for Windows and all my programs, and the other SSDs for games I normally and mostly play, such as Fortnite, Apex Legends, and stuff like that. And then the hard drives are for content and just, you know, bigger games such as GTA and Black Ops 4 and stuff. Uh, moving on to here then is my um, Line 6 UX2 for my mic. So my headset and my mic plugs into this thing. It can be a bit annoying sometimes. Um, if you ever use this before, you know, it can make your voice turn a little bit deeper. So you have to like unplug it, plug it back in again, restart pod farm. It can be a little bit annoying sometimes, but it's really good. It's just um, Trust C or GXT. Um, it's the exact same as a, um, what's the, a, G, a GT Omega or whatever the fuck they're called. Uh, it leans back all the way. You can rise the arms up and down on it. Um, it has then the, the pillows and stuff. So it's fine, you know, it's comfy. It's, you know, it's whatever, it's just a chair. Um, I have two mices then, obviously one for my streaming PC and two keyboards. So this is my streaming PC uh, mouse, which, which is the Corsair Galive, which is up there. And then my gaming PC mouse is the final mouse Ninja Air 58. My headset then is the Dero, Dero Dynamic or whatever the fuck, 990p Pros. Every streamer under Nan has this headset, as far as I can see. But it's really good, it's really comfy. You won't even notice you have it on your head, it's really light and stuff. My gaming keyboard then is the Ducky 12 Mini. 60% uh, keyboard has brown, or blue switches on this one. Um, which is grand, it's it's perfect. I wanted something sleek and slim. Um, there's no need for, you know, the number pad and stuff and the hotkeys, I didn't feel like. So it's perfect, it's true USB-C. My old gaming keyboard, which is the Corsair K95 RGB, and this one has brown switches. As you can hear, the box is up there. Corsair K95 Platinum. Um, it's perfect, I used to love this keyboard and I still do, it's just too big, man. Like the size comparison between this and this is insane. Um, my mouse mat then is a Steel Series. This is also a Steel Series 2. It's just a smaller one, so I have for my streaming mouse. And then this is my mic. This is the Rode, this is the Rode NT1. Rode NT1 XLR mic. 
lot of streamers have this um this is the first xlr mic i picked up which is you know it's perfect i don't think i'll be changing it for a while this is the rode psa1 mic arm as well so it goes extremely far i can just push it out of the way i can raise it up i can pull it all the way over to there push it back when i'm not needing it so it's perfect my webcam then is a logitech c920 which is the generic webcam as well under my desk then i have philips hue bloom lights they actually i have slots on my desk which are meant to be for cable management but it doesn't make sense because the backboard is like there so it won't make any sense so there are philips hue bloom lights i can change them through my google chrome as well um or google home should i say not chrome um this is my mouse bungee it's the zowie mouse bungee i just looked up mouse bungee because i wanted to because it's just easier so your mouse wire doesn't get caught like for this one it does get caught a little bit but it doesn't matter because it's just for the stream pc and then other than that i have my triple monitor mount um these two monitors are acer um g-sync 3d vision monitors um both 144 hertz including this one this is my newest one this is a this is a view sonic 144 hertz as well um, so they're both 24 inches, so this is for the streaming PC, and then these two are for my game PC, so I'll normally have chat up here, Streamlabs here, and then playing the game here. I'm not sure what my desks are, I only got this desk recently on Amazon, and I just wanted another white desk. And then other than that, I just have a few little knickknacks here, Kingdom Hearts Keyblade, just no pair of glasses, uh, Nintendo Switch Pro Control, just that PlayStation 1 remastered one, and then just a few little pops, and I'll just give you a show of the boxes that are up here just of some of the products I have. It's my laptop box, the Asus Strix ROG, and then these are the other boxes. I'll just give you a little point of view when the blackout blind is down, just to show you what it is like in the dark. With the Philip Hughes, I think it looks really good. And then over to the PC, and then to the laptop. So, that's pretty much it, lads. If you have any questions about anything, let me know in the comments. I think I went over everything and explained everything. As I said, if you have any questions, just leave a comment and I will answer anything you need to know. And yeah, I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.